morning guys and welcome back to journey to med for those of you who don't know my name is liddy and i'm a second year medical student today's video is going to be a study with me i have so much work to complete for medical school so today is going to be super productive and i thought why not take you guys along with me if you need some study motivation right now it's nearly 8 a.m i'm going to start making my way to university to get started with my work nice and early see you there So guys, my first task of the day is PBL, which is a problem-based learning scenario that I need to attend from 9 to 11 a.m. So that's what I'm gonna do while scoffing down some breakfast. For those who are unfamiliar about what PBL is, this is a problem-based learning scenario where we are given a clinical case to look at on a weekly basis and have to research and then discuss this with an allocated small group. During my five minute break, I had some Greggs and my current fave is a vegan sausage roll, a chicken bake, and also some apple juice. Right guys, so I finished doing my PBL. Um, it definitely dragged and I used to really like PBLs in first year, but I think now that I'm in second year medical school, I won't lie to you, I absolutely hate them. I feel like there are more compulsory things in the course that I could spend my time doing. But anyways, we move. So now I'm gonna do um, a few lectures that I have due this week. Right now we are on a module called Locomotor that focuses all on the muscles and the bones and stuff like that. Guys, if you're enjoying this video so far, then join the J2M family by clicking the red button down below and subscribing to Journey to Med. Once I finished my work, me and Hazal then made our way to the Queen Mary campus as a change in scenery always helps with our productivity. Hey guys, so we are now on the QM campus, but before we start studying, I wanted to tell you guys about AirUp who have kindly sponsored today's video. AirUp is a company that wants to make a healthy and sustainable lifestyle the most attractive choice and so have developed a water bottle that gives flavor to pure water with just air. Now, I know you're probably confused. I was too, but it's actually really, really cool. And I've got the bottle right here. Let's open it and see what's inside. So as you can see, it's a normal water bottle. Like it looks nice, it looks cool, but it looks like a normal water bottle. But then it also comes with these two pods. So I've got the tangerine one and the cola one. They've got lots of different flavors on their website. So you may be thinking, what do these pods do? Let me tell you guys. Fill up the bottle with water, put one of the pods in, put the straw through the bottle. And then when you suck the water through the straw, it transports water and air through the scented pods. So these things into your mouth. Now I'm gonna get a bit medicine-y, but what this does is it activates your retronasal smell, which is when you smell something, it passes through your throat to your olfactory center in your nose and manifests in your brain as taste. So basically you drink pure water, but it tastes like flavored water. By drinking this way, you get all the flavor you want without absorbing anything unnatural and keeping your body free of any sweeteners, any chemicals or any additives. So firstly, what you do is obviously wash the bottle and fill it up with water which i've done already as you can see and then you put the straw with the mouthpiece into the bottle which i have also done okay now you need to pick your scented pod i'm gonna try oh i'm gonna try cola i'm excited okay i'm gonna try cola so you just have to open the packet pick it up the packet gonna open it and you simply press it over the mouthpiece with the picture facing upwards and then you have to activate the pod by gently pulling it upwards until it naturally stops and then you drink from the bottle without tilting it What? Guys, this is so, so cool. It literally tastes like the flavor, but I know I'm drinking pure water, but it tastes like the flavor. So I've run out of water because I can't stop drinking it, but it's literally like magic. What the hell? As someone who's trying to increase the amount of water they are drinking, this is gonna come in so, so handy because I feel like I'm drinking flavored water when it's literally just pure water. And they are actually really popular in Europe and will be releasing in the UK soon. But if you guys want early access, you can check out the link in the description box down below and get your hand on one of these bottles. But anyway, that's enough water drinking for now. Let's go do some work.
Hi everyone, so I thought I'd just tell you guys how my work is going because um, I'm not made for lectures, I'm not made for this lifestyle, I'm really not. By mid-June I'll be done, I'll be free, free as a bird, I can spread my wings and fly wherever I want. But yeah, it's like this last final push and I feel like it gets really hard toward this time of the year because you've already been studying for like nine months and you're just tired, but this is when everything intensifies. As you can see, revision has clearly made us go mad. Following our shenanigans, we made our way to the last stop of the day, which was the library. You guys already know that this is my favorite study space on campus. Honestly, the aesthetics bring me so much life. When the glasses come on and the hair is tied back, that's when you know that things are getting serious. Once the study day was done, it was finally time to pack up. So guys, just finished at the library. I'm gonna yeah. head home now. I'm not gonna lie to you. I still have work to do when I get home. What Same. about you? Yeah. yeah, the work doesn't stop here just because we have a lot of deadlines and stuff. But I really hope that you guys enjoyed this study with me. How do you think it went? I think it was all right. Yeah, yeah it, it was, was actually quite well. Yeah, it was more productive than normal. No mm. cap. It was definitely more <laughs> yeah. productive than normal. So yeah, I hope it really gave you guys some study motivation and motivated you to study for exams or get that deadline done. We're all in this together, guys, and we're going to get through this academic term. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully. hopefully, fingers crossed. But um, I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you guys like, comment and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in a new video next time. Bye. Bye.